I was going to talk about Boston, and here's the thing. They have this whole gay marriage thing in Massachusetts, and they're fighting it in the courts, and I don't understand the argument against it legally. Like, I, I know what their problem is, but how do they do, argue it in court? You know, like, I can imagine the, the old, when they get to the Supreme Court and the gay, the lawyers for the gay side are like, well, Your Honor, we pay taxes. There's nothing illegal about what we do. We're the same as anyone else. Why shouldn't we get the same protection under the law that heterosexuals get? And then they ask the other lawyer, and he says, your Honor, they're fucking queer! <laughs> they're fucking queer! That's it, isn't it? Isn't that the whole... Well, okay, Counselor, but I don't see what that has... What, are you fucking faggot? <laughs> Your Honor, you gotta get a fucking beaten. <laughs> faggot! <laughs> isn't that the whole argument? <laughs> Or the, that argument that the soccer moms, I don't want to, how am I going to explain that to my kid? I don't like explaining things to my kid. I don't like talking to him. So you should stop your whole lifestyle. So that I don't have to talk to my kid, you should stop being in love with each other. Because, ugh. How am I going to, you know what, they, they, uh, fuck you, stop it. It's weird. But, uh, fuck, what was I going to say about that? Oh, yeah, like, I don't know. I never understood anger towards gay people because it doesn't affect your... It's actually the one thing that people can do, sex, that doesn't affect you at all. Nobody's being gay at you. <laughs> like you walk in a room full of gay people and, Oh, Jesus! Ah, oh, gay! I mean, where do you come in that you've got a good... Like, I can understand if you're mowing your lawn and two guys are blowing each other on the grass, like in the middle of your lawn, you're like, come on, you faggots! I gotta cut around you every morning, it's bullshit! Fucking lawn is all uneven! Or if you're eating your breakfast and you're about to put your spoon in the cereal bowl and two guys touch dicks in front of your, hey, come on! I gotta go to work! I don't have time to dig your, dig, dodge your dicks with my spoon? Outrageous behavior. Jesus didn't die on a cross so you could touch your dicks together in front of my cereal spoon. I'm sure that's not why. I mean, I wasn't there, but I assume that's not why. Couldn't possibly have been on his list. Anyway. Is that even a gay act, the touching of the two penises? I think that's what I pictured when I was a kid. That's what sex is between guys is just it's very formal. Just thank you. Well done. Well played. Right on target. I don't think that's even gay. That's just friendly. Hey, Bill, how you doing? How's this feel? How are you? Tip of your dick feels nice against the tip of my dick. I know, right?